today's video will be about uh, preparing some of the items that we grow in our garden here. Now, uh, if one has managed to get out of a big city and then uh, somehow land up in a forest farm situation with your growing your own food and all, you have to remember that the cash flow will uh, be very poor because by and large our Indian farmers don't make uh, money. They are actually losing badly, most of them and uh, they are continuing the profession because they don't know anything else. And uh, so once the cash flow is poor, you can still have a very fine quality of life. You just stop eating those uh, exotic stuff which comes from far away, off season and all which cost a lot of money. And anyway in your own garden you can't grow all that stuff. You will only get the seasonal uh, items. Particularly if it is uh, low tech and organic. So, uh, try, we try to eat the, we only eat the seasonal stuff by and large. And what we grow. And uh, when you preserve some of those uh, foods, it's good because you can eat it a little bit in the other seasons also. Now, one of the popular dish here is the pickle. And India is a land of pickles, like how Europeans have wine and uh, cheese. And the Koreans have kimchi, we have pickle. There are some uh, 5000 varieties of pickle. Every region has its own uh, variations and favorites and all that. And what I am showing here is a, is a recipe from Kurk, which I got from one of my uh, grand aunt. Now what you need the equipment is, on a totally dry and uh, no smell bottle like this. You can dry it in the sun so that it has no aroma else, no other aroma. And uh, then you need some uh, salt, rock salt. Try to get uh, pure rock salt from the ocean because the ocean water is containing all the minerals what our human blood contains in the exactly same percentage. So when you take the proper rock salt little bit every day, whatever minerals are lacking in your body, trace minerals and all, the body will be supplied. So get some proper rock salt like this. And then uh, you can uh, take a bottle like this and uh, put a layer of salt underneath like that and chop all those uh, vegetables which you are planning to add to the pickle like this and you can put it in layers into the bottle. Now for this episode I am just I am going to show you something that is already half done. That is, uh, actually it's a very nice concept called perma pickle pot. That is, you have a permanent pot of pickle which never empties. On the one hand, you go on adding the new item, new materials. And the pickled items, you can take out from the bottom slowly and eat it. Now, this is one of those older one. This is last year's lemons. I'll show. This pickle contains... Uh, lemon slices some chili and uh, pepper and all so like this you can take a big jar chop those lemons and uh, other vegetables and uh, add layers and layers of salt one layer of vegetable one layer of salt one layer of vegetable one layer of salt like that so uh, and uh, multiple vegetables can be added to this depending on your taste here our favorite vegetables are this bitter gold we add to the pickle and uh, ginger slices and some uh, turmeric, turmeric, fresh turmeric does very well in this uh, pickle. So various uh, spicy items and all you can uh, make it into a combo and then you can pick and choose and eat whatever you feel like at that point of time. Now this one is already half done. I am going to add some more ingredients. I hope it's visible clearly. Now we add some more salt on top. Shake it a little bit. I chopped ginger pieces, fresh ginger. 
they will drop it in and then you can add some garlic three piece of raw garlic and then some more salt then i also got now it's a pepper season so fresh uh, pepper we harvested so cut it into smaller bits so that at every meal you can take a few and then those can be added on top and these are the ripened uh, pepper pepper uh, berries i think no ripened so all these we can add on top and uh, for good measure you can add a little more salt also it's all right now shake it thoroughly and then preferably you can turn it a little bit and send the ones the new items to the bottom a little bit take out the older well pickled uh see lemon pieces are there at the bottom so you can uh, chop all these dry vegetables don't add water or even drops of water it will spoil and seal it and put it in the fridge this will last 4 to 5 years you can see here you can see ginger lemon turmeric orange color and uh, all of them are there so in the winter you can uh, if you having cold you can eat select the pepper in the summer it's too hot you don't want any spicy stuff you can take the lemon and have it and uh, if you are want really spicy you can add fresh chilies also to this and you get the chilies pickled chilies so this is uh, today's video about parma pickle pot so once the pickle is uh, say after a month the salt it starts uh, coming out like this now that's the lemon there and these are turmeric uh, slices curcuma long no, this is a very good antioxidant and also anti histamine it's good for allergic uh, some types of allergic reaction anti cancer tumor so many thing then pepper these are crunchy and uh, nice these peppers and uh, unlike the chili pepper has numerous uh, health benefits uh, one of its uh, marvelous quality is it breaks up the fat globules in the stomach so if you eating fatty foods like creamy stuff and or ghee you know you can eat or if you are having trouble digesting the oils and fats some liver trouble you know then you can add some of these peppers in your food it uh, aids the digestion of the fatty stuff in the stomach by breaking it into small particles then uh, bitter gourd and all everyone knows about it a uh, popular indian so you can even add carrot and other things i suppose we haven't done so far and uh, shelf life is good it tastes quite nice so I, you can all try it out it's easy to make you don't need to be a big chef and any big equipment or anything that's all for today